and pastor my apologies thank you so much ma for having me here today and allowing me to to, to minister on your platform on your pulpit it is something that i do not take lightly um i normally say this <laughs> never end. This is a very sad event that happened in South Africa. A crocust, a prophet, was shot dead during preaching in South Africa by a rival pastor, prophet whatever. The prophetic things is becoming another problem. I've never seen where a prophet is now standing to kill another prophet because of question or question or whatever. This man was preaching and he was shot dead, live and direct. This is a very, very painful act. You have seen the video, right? This is a very, very torture. We don't know what the man has put his hand. We don't know the gang he has joined. We don't know anything. But reportedly, he was shot dead. After he was shot dead, his spiritual father, you know, all these uh, young crockers, they have spiritual father. So his spiritual father went to Facebook to and posted something. Let me read it for you. He said, The truth regarding my son, Prophet Dwayne Gordon, the individual responsible for this, for the demise of my, of my son, is another prophet of the same ethnicity, driven by the fear of losing his congregation. Prophet Dwayne Gordon, nurtured under my guidance, was known to me as an exceptionally devoted young prophet and ardently devoted to Jesus Christ. It is truly outraging to witness the tragic waste of his life. His spirit will inflict anguish upon any individual implicated in it. His spirit will inflict anguish upon any individual implicated in his untimely demise. I vividly recall this. Stress incident that transpired in South Africa, malevolent forces orchestrated an instruction into our sacred sanctuary located in our Kiasa and Rastenburg branch, where he was shot on his leg, but he escaped. You can see the evil thing that is happening in the prophetic. How can you, and the unsanded, this same man, that sent people to go and murder this woman now, this young protest. We climb to the pulpit and preach. Who called you in the first place? Who is the person that called you in the first place? It is so disheartening. The evil things that goes around in the protest. That's how they do. They are so full of evil. I don't really understand why all these things keeps happening. It keeps happening, it keeps occurring every time. That is why I always tell people, not the kind of crockers you bow down to. You can see that even the so spiritual father knows but I don't want to give details because of, you know, investigation and everything. It is so, it's a pity that uh, Crocus Young doing the way your spiritual father described you, you are somebody that loves Jesus and everything. So painful that you just don't lost your life. Just like that. 
This word is cruel. This word is something else. How do you think the parents, the family, the people he left behind will feel now? Well, it's uh, a good thing that uh, somebody died in the service of his father. Thank God he was not shot in the hotel where he's a carrying woman. He was not shot. He was, he was shot when he was about to start preaching the gospel of Jesus. I think it's a plus for him. It's always good to die in the service or in the work of God. But on timely death, mm -mm, no, nobody wish for that. Are you the crocus that did this? No problem. You will enjoy your life, right? You will be happy that you have killed somebody. The wrath of God will come upon you. Please uh, don't forget, it's very important as you watch this video, share, comment, and don't forget to follow me, subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you and God bless you.